I guess we are live. Hi, everyone. Okay. Hello. I'm Renny, and uh, I'm here with Justin. Hello again. And together, we've pretty much tried to... We, we want to put together a Discord tutorial for you guys. For those of you that aren't familiar with the Discord app or haven't been able to use it that much, uh, we basically just want to make a tutorial on how you guys can get started with making your own account and joining our exclusive Elgin server. Um, you know, for the sake of the semester being online and stuff, we think it's a nice platform to use so that we guys, we guys, <laughs> we as a family can get more connected and, you know, just spend more quality time together. So let's go ahead and get started. If you guys go, okay, uh, don't look at that. If we go to Google, you guys can go to Google, type in Discord. Just click the first link. This is going to bring you to the official Discord app. Um, so right off the bat, you guys have three options to using Discord. You can either download Discord on your Windows or Mac. So you can download the application directly and then just run it through your computer. Um, you can have it run through a web browser. So maybe you don't want to download the application. You can just run it through the web browser like Chrome or you know whatever browser you use. Or you can download it on the mobile device. I'm not sure if Android has the option to. They do. They do. So whichever device that you have, you can download it on your mobile device and then you can use the mobile Discord app on your phone. I personally use it on my computer. I think it's just better for convenience and everything, but it's all up to you. So go ahead and go to the top right corner right here where it says log in and just click the login tab. Since you guys don't have an account yet, just go down here where it says register. Go ahead and fill out all, ooh. Go ahead and fill out all this information. <laughs> so just put in your email, put in the username and password of your, you know, whatever you want. Fill out this information. I think it's going to ask you to verify your email and everything else. But other than that, you're pretty much good. So once you go ahead and get your account set up and then, you know, whichever desired method you want to run it, go ahead and run your Discord. Um, so when you open your Discord, it's obviously not going to look like mine. It's going to be a little more blank. And you're not going to have all this stuff, but don't worry about that. Um, so once we go ahead and get the Elgin server set up for you guys, and whenever we do release that invite link, you guys are going to go ahead and input that invite link. You can either click it directly and it'll just open it up, or you can just go down here um, to add a server, click join server, put, uh, put in that invite link, just copy and paste it. But since I already have the link right here, I'm just going to click the link directly. And then it's going to bring you to the server. And so it's going to open you up to this welcome page. Please do take your time and go ahead and just read through all of this. It's going to kind of give you all the general information regarding everything on this interface and how to use it. Um, on the right hand side right here, it's going to show you the list of all the members in our family that's on Discord. And so it'll tell you who's online, who's not and just everyone that's in the server. We are going to have a tab like this, um, but not for mentors. It'll be a tab just for members. So that'll be just for everyone that's in the family that's on. And then, of course, you are going to have this mentor tab right here. It's just easier for you to distinguish uh, between members. And, you know, let's say you want to contact one of your mentors and they happen to be on. You can just access them right there. Uh, so this announcements page is just... Uh, it's just for us to give out any announcements that we have, maybe regarding any upcoming events or, you know, maybe we're doing socials or something. This is just where we're going to give you guys all the announcements and it should notify you. This roles tab. Um, oh, I forgot to mention, but upon joining this discord, we do ask that you guys go to the right hand side here and go ahead and just right click yourself and click change nickname. You should have the option to, and then, please do just change to your actual name just so we can all know um, who's who. But after that, you go ahead and go to this roles tab. This is mainly just for our gamers to identify or like just put a tag on you so people know. But you can just click these reactions right here and just react to these tabs and it's gonna basically just put a tag on your name, kind of like mine right here. 
just so we can kind of um, identify what games you play and it just makes it easier for us gamers to you know hit you up whenever we want to play something this dj role is just going to give you access to use the rhythm bot which is basically just like a nice little feature that we've added onto this server so whenever you guys are hanging out in a voice call you guys can just you know play some tunes and just jam and whatnot together so this is going to be the chat channels right here uh the general chat is just going to be used for you know general stuff that you guys want to talk about you guys can just talk hang out here pretty much similar to our facebook family chat but on discord you just talk uh talk about whatever you want here um the school chat is going to be anything exclusive to school so whether you guys have questions about homework or a class you need some help or anything related to school it's all going to be in here um game invites is just for the gamers that want to play maybe you guys want to hit up uh, hit up each other and get a party going or something just use this channel uh, we do ask that you guys use all these channels respectively for their purpose just to prevent any confusion and stuff um, the bot commands this is where you're going to type in all these commands um, you can learn it later but these commands are just what you're going to use to utilize the rhythm bot and just play music and use it however you want uh, these voice voice channels here um, the hangout rooms are just for you guys to join just to hang out whether it's for studying or just chilling or you know just talking whatever you guys can use those and then these game game rooms are just exclusive for um playing games and then we'll probably end up adding some more voice voice rooms as we go depending on what we need so maybe if we do like socials or something we might make some stuff and then we can just go ahead and tell you but uh yeah that's pretty much all there is to using discord um you have anything else to add justin uh you pretty much covered everything but if you guys have any other questions or need help with setting up your discord account or whatnot feel free to reach out to me and rennie we're we'll be more than happy to help you all out with that yep and uh i don't really know what else to cover but i mean with that being said hopefully it's not as confusing for you guys to kind of get your discord set up and everything um, but of course, if you guys do have questions, just go ahead and contact us and we can help you with that. But we mainly just wanted to use Discord as a way to get you guys more connected and just have another platform so that we can all interact with each other aside from using, um, you know, like Zoom and stuff like that, since Discord is kind of just a more social, casual version of that. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it.